you to Michelle Blackstad Chong. And I'm so excited about um, Michelle. And the reason that I am so incredibly um, excited is because she has had such phenomenal growth uh, this year. And I just think it is such a testimony to a little bit about what you've heard today as well. But I wanted to share um, that I met Michelle about three years ago and she was a consultant. And what I loved about Michelle was that she never missed an event. And, you know, one of the words that I would use to describe her is great loyalty. She's been such a, a loyal member of her, uh, her director team and of our company. And so whenever you have somebody that exhibits such wonderful loyalty, it just really makes you feel so good to see them really blossom in the business. So I asked Michelle if she could kind of a question and answer with me today, but we've got some background noise. So before we get down to that, I'm gonna go out and mute a couple of people that um, are unmuted. So make sure you don't unmute yourself accidentally because when you do that, it um, really creates a lot of background for us. All right, good morning, Michelle, or good afternoon, actually. <laughs> So Michelle, tell us a little bit about yourself. Tell us, you know, about your family and your occupation. What do you do for fun and what really motivates you? So, um, hi everybody. Like Tina said, I'm Michelle. Um, my husband, Sean and I have three grown children and 11 grandchildren. I work as a customer service rep for an insurance company. And in my spare time, I enjoy doing crafts with my grandchildren and reading and sewing. Awesome. So as I look back over your first couple of years, about three and a half years in Tupperware, you consistently averaged about four to $500 per month in sales. Tell me what your mindset, your thought process was um, about parties and, and how, what were you doing for those sales? Um, parties? Uh, no, no parties. Um, I didn't do parties. I just couldn't do parties. Um, each week I would choose um, several items from the mid-month brochure. And I have a list of customers that I would text. And that's how I got my sales for the month. All right. So, you know, with four or $500 a month in sales, you know, you weren't making a ton of extra money. You were probably just um, supplying your, your Tupperware habit, right? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. So then <clears throat> COVID happened and boom, you're close to $20,000 in personal sales for the year. Like girlfriend, I know, I'm so excited. You quadrupled your personal sales and you stepped up to manager. So what happened? Um, Facebook parties happened. Um, I started doing Facebook parties. I do um, three days of posting and I end with a live. So that's interesting because if you were uncomfortable in holding real parties, but you're comfortable with going live, what's the difference? My biggest fear was not knowing how to answer questions on the, at the party. And sometimes I had a hard time with product names and what you could do with them. And with Facebook parties, I share the information about the products in the postings. And if someone has a question, it gives me time to answer the question confidently. Wow. <laughs> so that, and that's really interesting. And, and so everybody really kind of needs to take note of that because there might be lots of people out there right now that could really relate to that. So yeah. if you had one piece of advice to someone that's listening today, that can totally relate to what you're saying, what would you say to them? Try Facebook parties. Um, it's fun. And the more you go live, the easier it gets. That's so true. And I've never seen anybody <laughs> die from going live, right? <laughs> yeah. I always yeah. say the hardest live is your first one. <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> That's right. Well, Michelle, I just want to let you know that I'm so 
so happy for you. And I'm very proud of, of the growth. You've stepped outside of your comfort zone. You're really very much so. my example for everybody. So thank you so much for, for sharing your experience with everybody today, because I know there's so many people that can really relate to you. So let's give Michelle a great big hand. Yay! Thank you. Thanks, Michelle. Thank you. Yay. All right. So now we are got some more goodies to do, you guys. Are you ready? Um